Hi, this is Amy from AmelianBoxes.com with this week's vlog mom. Actually, it's last week's, but I'm late, and I know you're all shocked by that. Um, but I felt like the topic was important. I know it was important to me. Julie Prawn from JustPrecious.com um, gave us our topic, which I love, but it makes me a little nervous. Uh, it's primary election season, and there are a lot of hot topics. Pick one you're passionate about and discuss. Um, here in North Carolina, we have Amendment 1 coming up for a vote, which would amend our state constitution, and the vote is in May, and it would, the amendment would define marriage legally as between one man and one woman, and I am voting against Amendment 1 in North Carolina. I respect that people have very different opinions, um, however, I identify myself as conservative. Actually, I identify myself in the middle, but on the conservative side of the middle. Um, I come from a conservative background, so my stance on this is going to make some of my family and friends a little nervous. Um, but I am in favor, first of all, my friends who are homosexual, who I think deserve to have a legal marriage just as much as I do. Um, I've been married for 16, a little over 16 years, 17 this fall, and I'm so grateful for that relationship, and it completes my life in a way that I can't articulate well on camera. Of course I want my friends to have the same legal recognition of their relationship that I am able to have. Um, in addition to that, I'm also in favor of less government. I don't want government in that part of my life. Um, churches are going to make their own decisions about how they define marriage and how they recognize marriage. But I think for the government to be involved in this is just too much. So I am voting against Amendment 1. I also think, you know, I think about my friends who are homosexual and part of same-sex couples and it would hurt my heart. I love North Carolina. It would hurt my heart if they didn't want to come and live here because of this law. Um, we don't need it. So, um, as I said, that's going to make some of my friends and family a little nervous. And that's okay. Um, I feel strongly enough about it to put it out there and shoulder whatever comes back. It's funny because I was having a conversation with a friend not long ago, someone who I really respect, and I come from a conservative background, and she comes from a liberal background, and I am probably not conservative enough for some of my family and friends, and she is probably not liberal enough for some of her family and friends, but I think there are a lot more in the middle um, who have to take issues issue by issue to decide how they feel about it. Um, regardless of how you feel, I do hope that you go out and vote wherever you are. And in North Carolina, I hope you vote against Amendment 1. Thanks for stopping by. And this Thursday, we have another Vlog Mom with um, another great topic. So be sure to check back by.